So, Ayush, uh, welcome to this session. Thank you, sir. Okay. I mean, we have had many placements before, and we hopefully will have many placements afterwards also. But this is one placement that actually has given a lot of job satisfaction to me personally and to the firm as Wall Street School. Okay, so because uh, there is a different story, and it's been great to have you as well. So, in case you could just tell a brief about yourself in terms of what is your background and you know, what you did. Yes, sir. Uh, so, starting, I'll say about prior to Wall Street, how I was. So, I, as a profession, I'm a chartered accountant. Mm-hmm. I cleared my. I did it in February of 2021. Okay. Attempt next of COVID. Okay. So I I've been a lucky chap. I cleared everything in the first go. So uh, starting with that, I started my career with ICICI Bank Limited in Pune in the mid corporate segment. As as what as a credit analyst. Uh, so I, I was in the management team. I was in the business team of ICICI Bank. Okay. So it was a part of seventy percent financial sales, so to say. Mm-hmm. Uh, after that, I belong to defense background. So there was always. a thing that i wanted to join defense as well mm-hmm. so it so happened that i cleared my ca at a young age and i had few years left so i thought ki i don't want to have any regrets i'll try nahi okay since your dad is uh, dad is into army or what uh, or your yes, sir, dad is in uh, air force he is in air force wow okay so uh, i gave the some while i was in icic but it so happened that i could not clear the written exam then I uh, thought that let's put our heart and soul for once and all into it. Let's give it a full try. Mm-hmm. So I uh, took a study break back then. It, I advanced to the final stage of the army and air force, but uh, was not lucky enough as I was in CA. So I could not make it through despite being a good one. But you being a CA, what was that a deterrent or was there anything else? Ki, uh, uh, no, no, it was because the uh, the requirements are very different. So. Uh, Uh, they are more personality based and they take the chosen one so there are no seats to be filled or no candidate to be taken they just just see that if the candidate is very right for the army and so despite the they, fact that the family lineage is into our matlab uh, in the air force uska koi bhi matlab nahi unke sath nahi sir it does not have any uh, forbearing so to say no benefits no given advantage no quota it is just what ayush choudhry is is for the army जर्नी केम टू एंड इन जून ऑफ दिस इयर दैट वॉज माई लास्ट You put a full stop there, or you uh, thought that are up, I mean, or or the years passed by. That is, you put up. The the years passed by. I could not. If I had the chance, I would still be giving that. <laughs> But, <laughs> so the years passed by. Uh, it so happened that after June, so there was a thought that what's next. Uh-huh. So there were as we belong to the profession. So there were many professions. You can go in audit. You can go in taxation. Then you can uh, do other finance. Uh, you can join industry. but i thought that if i want to restart my career i have to give it to the best thing mm-hmm. and uh, going to the market going to many people i thought that it would be investment banking mm-hmm. but there i was i was around zero <laughs> in terms of that i had no prior experience in that no many so to say relations in that part mm-hmm. so i was somewhere uh, i won't say that i put myself down but i was lost in a way that ab main kya kar sakta hu because uh, i cleared ca then tried for the army but what's next and many of your peers uh, jo ca aapke sath bane honge yes wo, uh, unka to career kick start ho gaya hoga to wo wala bhi pressure hoga na aapke upar indeed indeed there was uh, i won't say that i took that pressure but ha people used to say ki to kya kar raha hai aur kya kar raha so i uh, used to not take that to the heart but ha ek societal as we say i never considered that maybe it was in the blood ki mere ko baaki kya kehte hain usse fark nahi padta but uh, yes people did say ki acha hota hai ki career continue hi karta okay and your parents were very uh, supportive of your decision and they also wanted you to be in army or how, how was that 
or they wanted uh, their first dream yeah that was they would have liked me to be more in army <laughs> but it's fine they they said that uh, since now you're grown up and if you are so grown up that you decide to join the army then you are the best person who can take decision about yourself so mm-hmm. they were very chill about it uh, when they suggested that uh, you want to clear ca go for it but just put your 100% into everything that you are going to do you just that, not that you cannot do the thing teaches you uh, that army of give your best to i i cannot be that person that okay mai pehle uh, yahan pe kaam kar, kar raha tha ab mai nahi kaam kar raha hu so that should not to mind it was my 100% conscious decision to leave that and going for the army so i should not have any kind of thought in second thought in my head maybe that came with the upbringing i can say fantastic uh, so uh, so when i thought that what i have to do next that's when the thought of wall street came to my mind Mm-hmm. Uh, I've been following you on LinkedIn and the Wall Street on school on LinkedIn. So I thought, uh, in a way, I thought that uh, when I think of myself as a professional, so I want people to come to me because I have some expert knowledge in that. So since I do not have a bit, I lack in a uh, bit in this area. I should go to the one who is already an expert in this field. Mm-hmm. So nothing came to my mind. I just. uh the school i think the office is directly in cp so i stay in delhi i just rang up on the website and uh, asked that if i can come and inquire about the things and what will be the course and how everything will happen so uh, i prefer more in in person meeting than over a call mm-hmm. because it says a more, it says a lot about everything and I, i remember having met you at that time also yes yes, yes. and you know and when i was talking to you at the deep at the back of my mind i wanted you to join us <laughs> because <laughs> you know because it was a very very unique experience for us for me also personally and for us as a firm because we have had many cs uh, you know who have taken lot of attempts to clear it but not not a ca you know who has become a ca and then then taken a sort of a sabbatical you know to pursue something else and then then wanting to restart his career yeah. uh so one thing i think uh, us time pe bahut cheez clear hui thi that i want to mention uh, somewhere i uh, was putting myself down because i had given some interviews and from the perspective of the corporate side yes there was a gap of one year and four months mm-hmm. so i had this in the back of the mind that i could not clear the army exam so uh, now the demotivation level also yeah, that demotivation I, yeah. was there Mm-hmm. so then you said ki uh, to kya ho gaya you're still young you're still 24 and you tried something that most of the people lack so mm-hmm. they do not even try so you this is one regret i'm also going to have in my life ki, you know <laughs> never even try for it so i uh, you you specifically mentioned that don't put yourself down Be- just because you had a venture and it did not uh, turn into fruitful one doesn't mean that you did not do anything and after i after that meeting i went back and if on my, on that day i very much look back and i think jitna main shayad ca mein nahi sikhta utna maine yahan aane ke baad sikha during the during the ssb journey and the wall street as a person fine in terms of financial yes ca teaches you but in terms of life uh there were many learnings back then so you said ki don't put yourself down put your heart and soul to whatever thing you want to try fir i had no second thought i just booked the uh, booked the session ki uh, mujhe aana hai aur yahi aana hai and there was a uh, option of taking the online class to so, maine kaha nahi sir milna hai to sir se face to face jayenge there's there's no way out thank you great and you have been uh, means from the very first session i think i could see that zeal to do and zeal to prove yourself because you, you know you you deserve better right wo ye validation wahan se nahi mila for this incident hai but theek hai you know you put a full stop and then you got to move on and maybe excel in right. some skills the army way you know right. but, so that is that so is it's it's always come down to one thing that uh, we have to make a conscious choice and when we do that put your heart and soul and 100% to it no second thought ki ye ho sakta hai wo ho sakta hai nothing else so when i joined uh, the ssb side i gave my heart and soul to it 
find it could not go it but i'm taking the learnings from that side and applying in the investment banking side so when i came to wall street i was back up and again that i used to be mm-hmm. maybe i was putting myself down but after that meeting i backed up myself ki nahi itna just a failed venture doesn't mean that i failed i did not feel i even flourished in terms of my own experiences correct correct so that was a very big booster that even helped me in my interviews and you are I, among the very very mature 24 year olds that i have encountered you know at uh, at my end you know very mature very focused and i have i have reasons to believe that you know i'm going to uh, you know once once this video is done and you know it goes live i'm going to archive it because i know you are you have makings of a fantastic career ahead and uh, you know the people are going to know that in this person called ayush choudhary you know who is risen to this level right so you know and i'm absolutely confident of that right and Thank let's you. sure of it and uh, about the wall street i would say uh, even when i went to the interviews the things that i mentioned that i owned what i did in the last one and a half or two years mm-hmm. so to say i did not have anything in my background uh, ki even the failed world was not even in my dictionary mm-hmm. back then so when the interview was there it was in my resume that yes i did that prior to that i was hiding this part in not in my resume you specifically mentioned ki tune kuch kara hai put it in your resume you given the prime of your youth to it you know you have given your heart and soul to to it to to dalna hi hai yaar agar nahi chala to alag baat hai matlab but it is effort kiya aur wo wo hamesha life mein rahega ki yaar maine kiya nahi hua to that that's different yaar. maybe you're destined for some yes uh so that that's how i came here and that's so that was my journey fantastic and you have been a very very good student i think you have done most of the assignments <laughs> which which we had given uh, you know which given you to do or interview okay. experience kaisa raha i mean how how was it uh yeah so i would start the interview experience with terms of the wall street learning mm-hmm. so when we started uh, i would say that there was in my माइंड दैट मैंने तीन साल की तो आर्टिकलशिप करी एंड ऑल्सो है ईयर ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस इन आई सी एस ए बैंक सो ओनली थिंग दैट आई विल लर्न इज अबाउट फाइनेंशियल मॉडलिंग एंड वैल्यूएशन एंड इन टर्म्स ऑफ फाइनेंशियल मॉडलिंग आई थिंक आई कैन मैनेज बट स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम डे टू और थ्री वेन थिंग स्टार्टेड स्पीडिंग अप आई अंडरस्टूड दैट इवन दो आई हैव डन अ लॉट देर इज स्टिल अ लॉट टू लर्न इवन एट द बेसिक लेवल वी कैन डू वन थिंग इन एट Uh, separate ten ways. So, but me to visualize the, those ten ways, it was not there. It was just hard code one way of doing the work. But making that understand that you can do this as well, you can do this as well. You can do this as well. That came very handy in interview because uh, when you when they ask you questions in interview, they are not judging you on the basis of the knowledge. They are judging on the uh, thought process. Mm-hmm. and that thought process developed in the starting 3 to 4 weeks at mm-hmm. how can i visualize things that are asked, asked to me mm-hmm. so i took that learning and answered every questions in the interview excellent excellent or what is your advice to the fellow chartered accountants you know if you told you would want to uh join wall street <laughs> <laughs> uh yes so for the fellow ones that i will always suggest that even if we have done one thing uh it is fine to learn from the best it is very fine to learn from the best i would say that had i been in that bubble ki maine to kar liya hai ek baar i can manage in my world mm-hmm. i don't think i would have been a better version of myself than i am today 6 weeks previous to wall street and now i think there's a very big difference also and in terms of thinking so we got into a investment bank and uh, you know and uh, you have a fantastic mentor in rachit right yes, sir and he's a, he's a fantastic guy you know i know him personally also right uh, he is uh, you know in fact many of our very very good candidates you know who, you know who work with him and i'm sure you know so he's also very choosy about you know the sort of quality that he needs and that's it. uh also uh, one thing that i took handy was the financial knowledge Mm-hmm. you specifically mentioned in the classes that numbers are there number there are about 8 billion people in the world numbers are same for everyone how you take out that story is what makes you a gem 
so that came handy in terms of interview because when i was thrown some numbers i was also asked why hmm. so had i not visualized that story part because hmm. every number has a story behind it had i not visualized that story and taken that learning i would have just said that okay this was the sales growth or this was the growth or this ratio i will calculate but why do i have to calculate that learning i specifically took from you that every number has a story and uh, very confidently say that story as well mm-hmm. that that came very handy in interview fantastic and any any advice for the people who are pursuing the program i mean what what do you what would you want to suggest to them for them to clear the interviews also a uh, so suggestion would be that uh, take notes uh, they they can give you uh, almost 100000 10000 times of what you really are but how much you take from them is on you so if you teach me a thing and that's a very general psychological tendency of whatever i learn i think i'll remember but a week after that i'll forget hmm. so even if they crack a joke why <laughs> write that <laughs> because that will help you visualize ki class mein kya hua tha and uh, whatever we used to write in our classes i used to save that in one note under specific uh, pages so i made a a book of valuation so when we learned dcf i wrote about dcf when we learned basic things about options i learned about i wrote about that when we visualized about the storytelling part of the numbers i also wrote that so now if i see those notes i remember what i learned and that can only come when i specifically take notes of what you say because i may have understanding of something but aap jab usko kehte hain in a way it forces me to think rethink again ki ha this this means something and if i write that in my own words i think i'll remember that for life so absolutely take notes and keep revising keep revising keep revising correct and also uh, also uh, one thing you know and maybe that comes from the army background ayush uh, i think mujhe pata hai aapke jitne bhi interviews lined up hue the you're always there on time right uh, yes. Um, that that shows a sense of commitment purpose and attitude you know which also uh, the interviewers you know uh, jo aapka interview le raha hai usko bhi wo appreciate karta hai is cheez ko because we did get a message from them that the, the candidate is pretty 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 good pretty impressed uh, to add on to that sir uh, when i reached there so i reached about an hour before mm-hmm. i was just looking at the place uh, what uh, other businesses are there i was just visualizing of what really is in the background that came through is the uh, this uh, army background because being aware is very uh, far beyond being learned so okay. you can be learned in a way but you are when you are aware about things uh, things can come pretty good for you so when okay. i reached when when i reached early mm-hmm. uh, so even the founder was there early mm-hmm. and because we are wa- uh, waiting for someone to come we cannot start the interview directly so we had a very candid conversation even before the interview mm-hmm. so that was a kind of breaking the ice moment and it happened quite a lot in every interview i was there before time mm-hmm. so the person asked ki theek hai i already have a time for you so come let's have a talk mm-hmm. so we had a candid conversation and after that my interview happened so it it was a kind of not just an interrogation interview it was a conversational interview that helped me got it, got it. and also in the interviews i think you have to uh, you know it, it should not be a question answer round it has to be you know yes. conversational you know more yes. conversational it is more con- you know more easy it becomes uh, that because this the person is hiring a uh, an asset and not a inspector so to say <laughs> so he wants a person he can have day in and day out candid conversation because business is about people and people are uh, far more important than anything else so investing in the right people is what the founders look at and if mm-hmm. you are able to give them what they want i think they will hire you there's no issue. big fan of your maturity at your age you know it's 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 fabulous i mean this is going to take you you know quite 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 high you know in your professional and also in your personal life i i think that <laughs>
it's been great to know you uh, you know personally uh, you know we've had a lot of conversations also right and i wish you all the best as you you know sort of restart your career as a chartered accountant right and i'm sure you're going to you know you're going to rise fast right. i i can surely say i i may go from wall street but wall street will never go out of me <laughs> like my you you guys people like you you know are our typical brand investors you know that is that is great yes, uh, great ayush you know great to have this conversation and uh, wish you all the best absolutely on it sir you starting tomorrow absolutely starting tomorrow great more money chalo all my good wishes to you thank you all right thank you